I was coming in uh, early to see if I could see these rare glossy ibis that we've got here currently, um, which are roosting on this wild part of our reserve. And as I got near the hide, I could hear this fantastic bugling uh, call of a common crane. And uh, it was quite exciting. I knew they must be close. And then as I sneaked into the hide, I just poked my head around the corner quietly and I could see they were right up against the window. Um, so I took this uh, sort of rare opportunity, if you like, to grab my camera and um, just poke it around the corner so they couldn't see me and get a bit of shaky footage of them. I could see that the birds were um, firstly standing very upright and sticking their chests out and making this uh, extremely loud um, call that they do, uh, but also with their heads down, which is a, a sort of show of aggression. The hide itself is quite well hidden. It's got a grass roof, so it blends in very well. But also that that time of day, there's no reflection from the sun. So they would have seen their reflection only in the glass and were uh, making their, their display calls and um, showing that this is their territory. Cranes in general will uh, often investigate other cranes that they see or, or hear um, nearby, and it's very likely they've gradually sort of wandered over to, to have a good look and see who the uh, other cranes are. These actual cranes that we're seeing are part of the uh, reintroduction programme, the Great Crane Project, um, birds that have been released on the Somerset levels since 2010. And they've actually been going to and fro here and Somerset very regularly. Um, so the numbers fluctuate. We've had as many as sort of 17 individuals here. We regularly get to see them flying around, but this was quite a rare and unique opportunity to see them up close and uh, to be able to get the, the footage as well was excellent.